नमस्कार टुडे आई विल डिस्कस द आर्थोगोनल ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन्स फ्रॉम द फोर्थ टॉपिक ऑफ क्लासिकल मैकेनिक्स डिफाइन आर्थोगोनल ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन शो दैट फाइनाइट रोटेशन्स ऑफ अ रिजिड बॉडी अबाउट अ फिक्स पॉइंट ऑफ द बॉडी इज नॉट कॉम्पिटेटिव Consider x1, x2, x3 and x1 dash, x2 dash, x3 dash be two coordinates system. The general linear transformation between these two coordinate system is defined by the following set of equations. x1 dash is equal to a11 x1 plus a12 x2 plus a13 x3 x2 dash is equal to a21 x1 plus a22 x2 plus a23 x3 x3 dash is equal to a31 x1 plus a32 x3 x2 plus a33 x3 वेर ए वन वन ए वन टू डॉट 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 ए थ्री थ्री आर कॉन्स्टंट दीज आर दीज आर दीज थ्री इक्वेशन्स कैन बी कंबाइंड इन टू अ सिंगल इक्वेशन एज x i dash is equal to summation of e i j x j j is equal to one two three. For j is equal to one two three dot dot dot. Where a is equal to e i j is called the matrix of the transformation. Let a vector. R bar is equal to x i plus x one i plus y x two j plus x three k. Define in x one x two x three coordinate system. B transform to x one dash x two dash x three dash coordinate system in the form R bar is equal to x one dash i. Plus x two dash j plus x three dash k of the vector must be same in both the coordinate system. We must have therefore summation of x one dash square i is equal to one two three is equal to summation of x i square i is equal to one two Three. Using equation two in equation three, and we get summation of i is equal to one two three, a i j x j j is equal to one two three, into summation of a i k x k k is equal to one two three is equal to summation of x i square. I is equal to one two three. Summation of J is equal to one two three. Summation of K is equal to one two three. Summation of I is equal to one two three. A I K X I K A I J A I K X J X K is equal to summation of X I square. I is equal to one two three. Equating the corresponding coefficient on both the sides of the above equation, we get summation of a i j a i k k i is equal to one two three is equal to delta j k, where delta j k is the Kronecker delta symbol. And is defined by delta j k is equal to zero when j is not equal to k is equal to one when j is equal to k. Thus, 
any transformation to satisfied for is called the orthogonal transformation next example for show that two successive finite rotation of a rigid body about a fixed point of the body are not commutative solution consider two successive linear transformations described by the matrix b and a corresponding to the two successive displacement of the rigid body let the first transformation from x to x dash be denoted by the matrix b and is defined as xk dash is equal to summation of bkj xj j is equal to 1 to 3 where the matrix of the transformation is b is equal to b k j let the succeeding transformation from x dash to x double dash be defined by the matrix a is equal to a i k and is given by x i double dash is equal to summation of a i k x k dash k is equal to 1 to 3 i is equal to 1 to 3 now the transformation from x to x double dash is obtained by combining the two equations 6 and 7 as x i double dash is equal to summation of a i k b k j x j j k is equal to 1 to 3 i is equal to 1 to 3 this may also be written as x i double dash is equal to summation of c i j x j j is equal to 1 to 3 i is equal to 1 to 3 where c is equal to c i j is the matrix of the transformation from x to x double dash and the element of the matrix of the transformation are defined as c i j is equal to summation of e i k b k j these elements are obtained by multiplying the two matrices a and b thus the two linear transformation successive linear transformation described by the a and b is equivalent to a third linear transformation described by the matrix c defined by c is equal to a b since the matrix multiplication is not commutative. In general, hence the finite rotations of a rigid body about a fixed point are not commutative.